everyone and in today's episode we are gonna do 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 we're gonna compare oat milk with a nut milk so let's try this because a whole bunch of uh, oat milks and nut milks are going around so i was very curious to actually find out what the difference between a uh, nut milk and uh, oat milk would be straight off the bat yeah. it is thick it's thick it's really thick i can taste the rice i can taste the walnut but like in a <laughs> much more like milky milky creamy format and i really like the notes of walnut that is there because that bitterness it's everything yeah. it is everything you have it with coffee you have it with matcha you have it with all of these amazing things it will go really well hmm so i have it normally okay so this oat milk clearly is thinner it's much thinner. it's thinner because obviously there's no nut base over there mm-hmm. So yes. there's I'm assuming there'll be more uh, water content in this or something like that I don't hmm. know. Oh wow. Oh um, there is a distinct difference and now I can taste the oat. Mm. In the previous one I couldn't really I mean yeah walnut I could but here the oat taste is really really out there. You know what what this reminds me of this reminds me of a breakfast cereal. It <laughs> It does. Right? It does. You can, you can. If you get the milkiness, you get the oatiness also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's both there. I think both of them would go really well with coffee. Mm. With tea, maybe this one, but then I'm not sure. Yeah, because I think that will add a flavor. Uh, this is more bland in it. So although the oat is pretty strong, strong but I think but with the tea, it will. It's a neutral flavor. This yeah, one has this like one a is overpowering. Nut. Yeah, correct. So great. So you can discover a lot of these nut milks and oat milks. We have a fabulous collection yes. on Wildemar.